tonight, how far will China go? After Speaker Nancy Pelosi becomes the highest ranking U.S. official to visit Taiwan in 25 years. The Speaker of the House arrives on a U.S. Air Force plane to fanfare and China reacts. Warships surround Taiwan and Beijing promises a strong and forceful response. The planning behind a strike on a balcony in Afghanistan that killed al-Qaeda's leader. New details tonight about how the U.S. tracked down one of the masterminds of 9-11. Helping America's veterans. After days of protesting from comedian Jon Stewart and dozens of veterans groups, the Senate votes on a bill to expand benefits to warriors with toxic exposure from burn pits. Primary day across America. Voters in five states go to the polls tonight. What we might learn about the elections this November and the ones in 2024. Plus, Kansas becomes the first state to vote on the future of abortion rights. Confronting a liar. I wanted to tell you to your face, my son existed. The mom of a Sandy Hook victim addresses conspiracy theorist Alex Jones. They picked the wrong guy to mess with. Robbers with an AR-15 style rifle target a liquor store, whose 80-year-old owner greets them with a shotgun. And finally, an NBA champion on and off the court. What this former LA Laker is doing to raise money for the children of Ukraine. This is the CBS Evening News with Nora O'Donnell, reporting from the nation's capital. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm John Dickerson in for Nora. Tonight, U.S.-China tensions increase after House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's arrival in Taiwan, the highest ranking American official in 25 years to visit the self-ruled island that Beijing claims as its own. Pelosi was greeted on the tarmac at Taipei's International Airport by Taiwan's foreign minister and other Taiwanese and American government officials. In a statement upon arriving, Pelosi said the visit honors America's unwavering commitment to supporting Taiwan's vibrant democracy. China responded to the visit by putting its military on high alert and announcing a series of military demonstrations in the waters off Taiwan. CBS's Nancy Cordes starts us off. The guessing game about Pelosi's plans ended with this late night touchdown in Taipei.